Hi lovely Libras and a very happy birthday to you early Librans and uh, this month is somewhat quieter up there in the astrological heavens than it has been really for the past uh, previous months. So it's going to be quite important for you lovely Libras because there's a lot happening in this 12th house. You're coming to the end of your year. Your birthday heralds a new year for you. So really it's happy new year for you from about September 23rd, 24th when the sun comes into your sign for that month. And here it's very important to take some time out, to relax, to be, just be, to be in nature, to listen to music, to be with animals and birds and trees, to be near water, to do some journaling, some writing, anything that takes you to that peaceful place where you can reflect upon the year that you've had, the things that you feel you've done well, the things that you would, might like to improve, what your dreams are for this coming year, starting with your birthday, this is all what this activity is about in this 12th house for you. Mars will be in the 12th house all month, so it's a good time to put energy into astrology, numerology, metaphysics, anything in this esoteric field where you're delving into the unseen and also into your internal world. Very important to connect with the internal because once we hit your birthday, the planets begin to move forwards and then you're going to be dealing a lot more with the external world again. And the external world is always pulling on you in one way or another. And so this is a, almost like a sacred time, important to set aside holy time just for you. You'll be very glad if you're able to do that on a consistent basis. Now all month we've got Neptune square to Jupiter here asking you to go beyond what you think is possible. Yes, to really know that you can achieve the impossible. You just have to believe with Jupiter. It's about what do you believe you can have, the abundance you'd like, to do the work that you love, to have a relationship that's special to you, to have beautiful friends in your life. If you can believe it and feel it as though it's already happened, good health, then you'll be amazed at how quickly you will manifest this, all these things in your life. It's a powerful time. Might not be so much happening, but what is happening is potent. On the 13th, 14th of the month, we've got a full moon in your sixth house, resonating there with Neptune, encouraging you to tune into your physical body. What does it want? What does it need? Does it need more rest? Need more sleep? It's also asking you here to tune into anything that's going on. You can make the corrections. You are your own best healer. You can use that mental energy, that internal going within, to find your answers, to bring about a stronger energy field for yourself and to feel more energized and alive. Something may come to a head with a work situation and you may end up changing your job or changing the uh, career direction in some way. And on the 15th of the month, we've got Venus, your ruler, woohoo, coming into your sign along with Mercury. This is wonderful for you, lovely Libras. And uh, Venus in your sign makes you popular, people drawn to you, magnetized to you, even more than usual. It's also uh, a good time to pamper yourself, do something that makes you feel good, that you feel beautiful. Very important for you, Libras. And then on the 23rd, 24th, the sun coming into your sign. And on the 28th, a lovely new moon in your sign. So this can bring you new romance, new love, a refreshment of your entire body being revitalized, 
Maybe you'll go to a spa or have a massage or something that really makes you feel good. This is the time to do it. And you could well draw somebody new into your life at this time. And it's an opportunity for a lot of self-discovery, self-growth, self-confidence, walking around knowing that you have something that is unique to you that nobody can compete with. So I wish you a wonderful birthday. You might like to have a personal reading showing what 2019, September 2019 has in store for you. I'm always delighted to hear from you. And if you like the video, please would you give it a thumbs up. Bye for now.